So I've already told you how to link your Facebook page to your Facebook group. Yes, very, very good. There's super big benefits and those super big benefits are that Facebook promotes engagement and engaging groups and they don't really promote Facebook pages. So what I have not told you is that you can now post as a page on your Facebook group. Now, why would you want to do this? Well, there's several reasons. Sometimes your brand is not you. Mavi Hairdresser is um, me, yes, and I can post as myself or as my page. If I want to promote my page on my group, I would post as my page. Now, let's say I'm the administrator and I am of other people's groups. So I'm an administrator, but I don't want to bring the attention to me. I don't want people to know on that person's Facebook group that it's me posting. I just want to post as their page. So this enables me to highlight their page and highlight their brand on their page without bringing attention to myself, which is great. So if you have a group and you want to stick to the the subject matter and you want to stick to uh, what you were talking about and not bring attention to the personal person that is doing it, have them post as your Facebook page on your group. It's easy once you link your page to your group. So that must happen. So let's go to my Facebook group. I have already matched up my group to my page. They're already linked. Now, when I write a post, I can type something here. That's a, certainly the lot. And I can post as Mafi Hairdresser the page or I can choose a different posting I can choose by myself to post as me. And you can see that the picture will change. So in the right hand corner, you can post as Mafi Hairdresser the um, salon page or you can post as Mafi Hairdresser the author page, which is what I would do. So that's as simple as it is. You can change that um, only, you can only post as a page on your group if you have already linked your page to your group. So that's super, super duper information. There is something else I want to tell you, and that is on your Facebook manager, go to your business manager and click on the top inbox. That inbox used to be what was called messages. Well, now you're going to change that to inbox and you're going to see right here at the top, it's going to say switch to the new inbox view. Now you'll have messages and these are messages that anyone has messaged you uh, to your page or your um, Facebook group. When you click here, your Facebook pages that you post as the page member, as the page, if you post on your group as a page, it's going to show up here, plus all your posts on your Facebook page. So you can manage them both right here in the inbox in the business manager. You will have a Instagram um, toggle where you can manage all of your comments on Instagram here as well. You just have to have a business account for Instagram. And I find this so much better than going to Instagram. Uh, go here. This is so much easier. I, I love, I love this because I can comment right back here on my business manager page and it's, it's super simple. So I hope this was helpful and I hope this really, uh, helps you to understand that Facebook pages and groups really work well together and that you can manage your Facebook group in business manager just like you can do for your pages. So that's it.